Hello. My name is April McIntyre, and I am a junior at GW majoring in anthropology. As a research assistant in the Department of Microbiology, Immunology, and Tropical Diseases, I am involved in research into plant compounds that may someday lead to treatments for hookworm and other neglected diseases of poverty. And my name is Hamza Rahimi. I'm a senior at GW studying political science and biology. In addition to founding the GW chapter of Triple Helix, a student-run international journal on science and society, I have also worked on research projects in the field of emergency medicine and breast cancer. While many students around the country switch out of STEM fields during college, we have both been attracted into these fields because of first-hand experiences at GW that have allowed us to work on scientific research that has the potential to change lives. But today, a generation of young aspiring scientists, doctors, and engineers could see opportunities like these pulled back by cuts to federal science programs like the National Institutes of Health and the National Science Foundation. These government agencies fund innovative research on college campuses that create new companies, new products, and new jobs. But they also provide resources to educate bright students with a passion to change the world through science. Cuts from the sequestration will close off this essential pipeline, limiting the options of students across the country who are just like us, as well as damaging U.S. competitiveness around the world. Please tell Congress to stop cutting scientific research and avert the sequester. Let's make sure that our country continues to invest in our future.